The game has saved, and I'm going to fight a disgusting, to say the least, creature. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh, shit. It would be great if it was one. Hello beautiful people, Readers here with the continuation of the Two Worlds 2 Call of the Tenebrae Let's Play series. So, in the previous episode I was left searching for a pathway to go to my next quest and I later realized that hey, it was here in the first place but I just had to jump here and follow this uh, mountain uh, path or whatever it is. So yeah, again, what a bummer, I, I screwed up with uh, my orientation, if that's that's the proper word. Whatever. A fun fact is that I've climbed this before, so I should probably know about it, but never mind. That is still fine, okay? Since I found it now. So let's see. Ooh, this statue there. That is so awesome. Let's see if uh, there are still giants fighting here. Oh my god, I love, I love extremely huge big statues. What is that? Oh, there's a new teleportation! What an awesome thing! I wish I had this... I have had found this before. Where should I go now? Let's take a look at my map. Oh, why, why the map is cropped like that? I don't like it. Don't like, don't like. So, I guess that I need to go this way. Yeah. Alright, uh, it looks like I'm taking quite a few fall damage here. Quite a lot fall damage, actually. And that is interesting. Uh, and I'm, I'm in a bad situation now. So that is actually the place where those rock giants were fighting and they fell. They fell. Can you freaking believe that? And we found a new teleportation. Oh, that's what this is serving. Don't tell me. Oh, yeah. There is the... There is the... Okay. That is awesome. I, I, I definitely shouldn't uh, jump there. I definitely could avoid taking the damage. So if you're watching this video and you have not played it yet, definitely avoid taking the damage. There is a teleportation there. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know about it. Can you freaking believe that? Ah. Maybe next time. Yeah, maybe next time. Maybe next time. What a bad experience with those lockpicking things. Oh, 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 shit! What's wrong with you? Alright. Alright, uh, let's ignore. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right direction. But I'm pretty sure that I need to ignore. Alright, those are easy to knock down, but the skeletons are definitely not. Oh, oh, oh no! Shit! Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me now? I definitely was not going the right direction, man. Alright, let me quickly knock down this... Freaking shit. What do you have as loot? Hearts? Or do you even have, have a heart creature? You don't look like a creature with a heart. Hyena's heart. Healed mild wounds. But I thought that this was a flower or something. Alright. Um, okay, look where I am and look where I need to go and look where I went. That is embarrassing. Okay. Oh, no! Come on! It's a leech! I think that I should... Oh! Where did that came from? Shit! Those controls! They're freaking bad. Stay down, leech. Ah. 
damage. All right, he's having tons of fun. No, don't shoot. Oh, I hate that. I hate this level. It's like extremely tough to avoid it. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right direction here. Alright, that was enough. Oh, at least they are one hit most of the time. So, okay, let's just do a quick map check. Uh, looks like I'm not going the wrong direction at least. This may be not the optimal. No! Take this. Okay. One more ahead. Alright. Wonderful. Let's completely ignore the skelly. Oh my. Ah, that was way too far away. All right, let's let's ignore it. Let's actually try to ignore everything. No, it's not possible. Dude. And it's kind of worse to have them in your back instead of in the, on the front. I I would love to have a cure all poisoning now. All right. That looks like a useful thing. Yeah, there is a chance that I uh, screwed up for good now. Alright, let me quickly check them up. Map, map. Ah, oh, I need to switch to take them up, to check them up. Let's do a fight, shall we? No. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. Uh, I'm gonna take another cure all poisoning. Ah, Jesus! Open the freaking door! Oh my gosh. I do need to fight those guys now. What a terrible place to be trapped. Oh my. Okay. How can skeletons like uh, be so resilient to such attacks? I mean, I'm, he's a skeleton and I'm hitting him with a heavy axe. How, how can he ignore the damage? I mean, what the hell? Oh my! Alright, rest in peace everybody. I'm sorry, I'm sorry my friends, that was a very bad fight, I know. I'm gonna lo I'm gonna loot a few things because I kinda need to make sure that I'm gonna get a few items that I need. Especially lockpicks, that's that's an awesome item to get. Ugh, that's still alive, sort of. Ah, uh, what was that? Ooh, entrails. Okay. Don't say I didn't warn you. Dude. There is still Oh my gosh. There is still one of these right there attacking me. Alright. 
Oh my god, can you see what's ahead? Yeah. Ah, and it's also hitting me. That is definitely disgusting. Do I need to go? Oh my. I need to go there. My friends, I believe it's time for a save. It's time for a save. The game has saved and I'm going to fight a disgusting to say the least creature. So let's go ahead and do that. Oh shit! It would be great if it was one. Ah! That is definitely not one. Uh. It's not that tough. Definitely the poisoning is one. Oh! I, I hate it when I miss my attacks. I don't like... Oh! It, that's the second time! Okay, let's focus straight on, on the target. Almost there. One down. Okay, one is down. I'm pretty sure that I could avoid fighting those guys. Or, I'm actually not pretty sure, but I guess that I could avoid fighting them. But I kinda want to. Alright, that's another dead one. My friends, aren't them disgusting? What do you think about this? They look quite disgusting to me. Oh, don't jump there. Alright, I leveled up, apparently. Okay, let's loot those disgusting creatures. Ugh, got eyes and stuff. The fun fact is that I'm brewing potions with those eyes and stuff, and I drink them. Can you imagine? Twenty percent. Ah! Are you kidding me? Twenty percent is like one should open. Not really, but yeah, whatever. I cannot tell what's in front of me. Actually, did I go back? Yeah, I went back. That was a bad idea. Ah, don't block me. Oh my god, it's also moving. Few more to kill. Where are you? Uh, locked. Improved lock. Break lock 40% damage. Oh, two birds with one stone, I believe. That is awesome. Let's hope that this is my last opponent here. Until we go... Ah! <laughs> Until we finally... We have another one of these. They never end. I had a checkpoint. That's cool. It looks like we're finally in the end of the road. All right. We succeeded. I need to. I need to read now. That's not exactly what I was meant to do. Okay. The Mothark settlement. I need to explore the swamp carefully. Some of these look like man-made structures. The walls must be from the Tenebrae times, but those simpler structures seem relatively new and are no doubt of Mothark design. That's not enough information, right? I need to explore the swamp carefully, but what's, what's the objective here? Let's check them out. Little creatures here. Dead bodies there. Uh, looks like there is a flag in front of me, so I do have a target. Zombie! Oh my god, what was that? What is that shit? Dude! That is like 
Oh my. Those are not easy targets. God, let's loot those things. Let's see what they better be worth it. Yeah, you better be worth it, man. Oh, I I I think that I equipped the shield by accident. That is my weapon of choice. All right. Ooh. Looks easy. Let's gather a few new types of herbs. Not I, now. I really don't know where I have to go, but I'm pretty sure that I need to follow this path. That looks like something interesting, we'd say. Oh! The wolves are like getting killed extremely fast and easily, but this thing, this thing is a tough one. To say the least. Alright. I would greatly prefer a faster loot system. So I'm going to skip those for now. Let's see if there is a passage here. What was that before? Alright. I thought that I s I, I see something. What is it? Herbs like? Yeah, herbs, okay. Herbs, sorry. Just wasted some time here. Alright, going straight. Oh teleportation! Yeah. What type of creature is that? <laughs> Sorry, I don't speak Mothark. I cannot understand you, man. You said it. So I'll just make my way through your swamp here. And go ahead and get out of your hair. Is he really is he really talking with him now? Oh, yeah? And why not? So can he really understand? I I don't get it. He said that he doesn't speak this I don't language. understand you. Ah, okay. How do I know that he understands me? That's an interesting conversation here. We have a very interesting conversation here. Are you saying <laughs> a green worm will eat me? If I try to leave, how do I understand? Doesn't make sense. It feeds on your people. Maybe that's a side quest. I need to help him uh, get rid of this thing that feeds on his people. Thank you for the warning, but whatever this worm is, I'm not concerned. I will fight it. Yeah, I'm <sighs> sure it does. I'll this, be on my way. This is one of the most interesting conversations that we've ever had in this game. <sighs> Come on, you're a tit tatter. He's a fisherman. Right. So now, just gonna. F um, okay. What? What's? What's that? Let me quickly read through those things because look like they are quite important. The locals tell me that I need to find a shaman named Gorgar if I'm going to have any chance of getting out of there. Of here, he's in the village by their altar. That's a good piece of information. Great murky words. The Morkars, Morthark spoke of a creature they call the Green Worm. It guards an exit of the, swamp, the exit of the swamp. Great. Out of the marshlands. I've got to get through the swamp and find an exit into the tribe's territory. And the Morthark's mine. There is an oily smell in the air, and Morthark's are known to mine oil. Since no one else in their right mind would choose to live in a swamp, there has to be an active Mothark mine around here somewhere, and if there is a mine, there has to be a settlement close by. Alright. 
So, I guess that we continue. A new cinematic. Ooh. Please tell me that those are friendly. I wouldn't uh, wish to fight them. <laughs> uh oh. No, don't go to the fire. Oh, great. Great, now we have a fire. The flames from the exploding barrel are still burning, or even on the swamp water. Must be mining pure oil in here. Um, is that of my concern? I mean, do I have to do anything? I'm actually stealing his their oil. I, I'm actually kicking it. Oh, that that doesn't look well. I don't like this idea. I really don't like this idea. But let's do it. Why it's not Oh, come on. All right, it's it's not moving on its own. I mean, it's suicide in order for opening this thing. 26%. Oh, are you pissed off? This is a glitch, probably. This is probably a glitch. So, let's quickly talk to this... No, he's not willing to talk. Let's throw a barrel. Let's see if it's going to... Move toward the fire by itself. Yes, it did, but it didn't explode. All right, uh, wasting time, wasting time here. What is that? Oh, look, herbs and tons of potions. Potions like for every single situation, but only one health. Ah, wish I could say that I like that. What, what was that for? You, smooth skin. Ooh, we you speak English. We don't see many of your kind here. Oh, you what speak happened English? to the you, who man? Me, Mothark talk. I'm the smartest Mothark in tribe. <laughs> That's why I make big eels as the shaman. Just hmm. the man I'm looking for. I need to get through this swamp, and I'm a bit lost. Shaman. And I'm supposed to watch out for a worm. green worm. Getting through is simple. Just cross bridge above worm's lair. The worm will come out, rip you to pieces. <laughs> then there's no need to leave anymore. Okay. Or I might know another way. But Tell me. But only mud is free in Motark marshlands. All right. I get it. How much? <laughs> what would I do with your smooth skin money? But a favor. Now we are talking. All right, what a do you want? A while ago, my idiot acolyte Torgo decided our gods were obsolete. Mm -hmm. He said new gods had visited him. Worse, he found fools who believed him. Those carpets abandoned our tradition and founded their own pisshole village. It's still standing, and Torgo's cult is growing. They call themselves Deep Ones. All right. As if we were shallow. Okay. <laughs> so, this Torgo guy is a thorn in your side. He's whole thorn bush in my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I need to get rid of him so village can get back to normal. Okay. And you want him to sleep with the fishes. What? No. Why would I wish carnal pleasures for him? No. I want him gone. 
dried. Nothing but scales left. Okay. All right. Um, I will help you, but I'm not killing anyone. A favor is sharing some extra jerky. Killing a fish man is not. Uh, I need some time to think this over. No problem. He will drown soon. I'm gonna go for. I'll one. help, but I'm not Why? killing anyone. A favor is sharing some extra jerky. Killing a fish man is not. Fine. Then find a way to make his followers leave. Show them that he is a fool. Make them come back. Okay. Especially the women. Then I show you the way out of swamp. I'll All right. find him. Avoid the guards in his village if you can. He gave them proper brainwashing. They'll attack you on sight or on smell. On smell? Uh -oh. It might be a good idea to mask your odor. I have nice, freshly rotten mudfish spleen. If you want to oh. spread its juices on your body. Oh no. No thanks. I'll take my chances with my smooth smell. Uh, I agree. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure, man. You could sprinkle yourself with it for your own pleasure. Oh my god. Not for safety. Oh my god. It's been decomposing for three days. Aroma is at its peak. Yeah, I'll think about it. <laughs> the fun thing is that he, he thinks that uh, it is attractive to me to, to do that. Okay, so Korgar is here. He's the salmon of the tribe. Um, I'm just quickly gonna check out my, my improved quest log now. A salmon named Korgar told me um, he can help me escape if I take care of his rival, a cult leader named Torgo. I have to head to Torgo's enhancement... Uh, and can encampment and see if I can bur bust up his happy little band. Alright. Let's see where this thing is. Oh no dice game. I don't like dice games. Oh, we have a shopkeeper. Potions would be greatly appreciated. Looks like they're quite more expensive at this moment. At this place. Let's purchase two. I don't use my auras anyways, so yeah. Okay, so let's play for a bit longer. Let's actually press X and see the map. I'm not exactly sure where I want, when I need, where I need to be heading. Where am I exactly right now? That X is probably the layer of the uh, green wimp, so I definitely should not go there yet. Uh, those are probably extra quests. This is a... Um, okay, I believe that I'm somewhere here. And I, All right, I think that I'm in the right place, right? Yeah. Going to the village, I need to get undetected and that's something that I seriously doubt that is possible for me. At least at this moment. I don't think that I can make it. Ooh. Did I find the ring? Seriously? Alright. So, to be honest, I'm in trouble. Something is freaking attacking me. Something is freaking attacking me and it's attacking me good. One more hit and I'm dead. I cannot tell what freaking shit is attacking me. So I think that this is a good place to end the episode because I need to investigate the area a little bit more and get back to you in the next one. We're going to definitely find this guy and just dethrone him and return his people to the other tribe. So I really hope that you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please make sure to 
support it with a like if you didn't uh, just slightly push the dislike button leave me a comment below be safe take very good care of yourself and i'm gonna see you in the next one until then bye my friend